Well, a heads up for drivers in Grand Rapids later this week, a new and unique pedestrian signal will be up and running. Emily Leonard is here to explain how this works and why the city's installing it. You guys, it's called a pedestrian hybrid beacon, and the city will flip the switch this Wednesday. Here's where it will be. It's on Michigan Street near Banton Avenue. That's between Plymouth and Fuller. It's designed to help make crossing Michigan easier for pedestrians. So here's how it works. This is video of one in action. The pedestrian will activate it. The light first flashes yellow and then changes to solid yellow before changing to solid red. Now that will stop traffic while the pedestrian crosses. Drivers, you treat it just like a normal light. Yellow means prepare to stop, and of course, red means stop. This is the first pedestrian hybrid beacon in West Michigan. The city says it was needed in this area thanks in part to a new free fare bus route. It was added to help ease some traffic congestion along Michigan Street. It increased foot traffic from about 50 people a day to 1,000. The intent is to allow pedestrians to safely uh, traverse the streets, so it's just like anywhere else throughout the system, depending on where you are, and so we're a changing, growing city. And so these ways, it helps, it, it pre preserves safety for everyone and for all users, especially our most vulnerable users. For most of the people who drive this corridor, they will not experience huge amounts of delay because there is no traffic signal that exists today between Plymouth and Fuller. The beacon cost the city about $150,000. They tell us there aren't any immediate plans to add any more of these, but they're working on other similar pedestrian crossings around the city. Again, this light will go active on Wednesday. We have information on how to navigate it for drivers and pedestrians over at woodtv.com. Sue?